This is a Blaring Out with Eric Blair show tonight. Rocking the red carpet at the premiere for Dio, Dreamers Never Die, the documentary film celebrating the life of heavy metal legend Ronnie James Dio. Here with the film directors of Dio, Dreamers Never Die, Don Argot and Damian Fenton. So what was the most challenging thing about putting this together? Dem could probably speak to this equally, but it, we had so many elements to work with um, but at, but at the same time not a lot of elements in terms of like it wasn't like you know there you see a lot of documentaries that are like oh this footage looks like it was you know shot 40 years ago for the purpose of making a documentary about this we didn't really have that with Ronnie we had like little snapshots we had interviews that you did with him we had interviews with other people we had you know little tidbits and stuff and that's how we had to piece the story together in a very kind of like sporadic way because we're just using all these elements to get the story told and, and as close to Ronnie's words as we could as a filmmaker yourself, how satisfied are you with the final product? Totally satisfied. And with this film, we had to balance that thing out of like, the fan in me wants to just watch raw footage and listen to interviews and make a five hour film. The filmmaker in me knows that's not a great story. And so we had to balance the two more than any of our films, I think, going into this as just like total fans. But I think we, we got there and I think we, you know, it's a hard movie to make because Ronnie has four careers in one span, one lifespan. Um, but you learn a lot. You learn a lot about Ronnie, but you also go on a total emotional journey. And that, that's what was our aim from the beginning. And it's, it's, it's about chasing your dreams. It's certainly about Ronnie's music, but it's really about chasing your dreams. So the takeaway from this film is it's about chasing your dreams. I think it's believing in yourself. It's all the things that I think, one of the, the, the most beautiful things about this experience right now, what's happening, is that Demi and I likely would not be here if it wasn't for Ronnie and heavy metal and punk rock and the music that we listen to because that for me and I know it has for Dem has shaped our identity. It shaped what we got into. It shaped what how we looked at the world. And so the path because of those things was really laid out for us to end up exactly at this place. And that's what's so beautiful about where we're at and what this is all about really is coming to celebrate this incredible human being that um, it touched all of us. All right, you guys, God bless you. Have a great night. The Blaring Out Show.